So, Ollie has sourced oil in the nick of time for the opening of the restaurant. First of all, I'm shortly going to marinate the beef with a bit of garlic and some of this lovely rapeseed oil and a pinch of pepper. Salted boiling water, potatoes going in. And I only want to half cook those, don't want to cook them all the way through. And then in the meantime, I'm going to prepare my leeks. And naturally, I'm going to be using rapeseed oil to cook them in. I'm making quite a lot of this because I've got a feeling it's going to be really nice. So we're going to cook these down with some salt until they're really soft. This oil is much healthier than olive oil. It's uh, got much less cholesterol and it's got more omega-3 oils as well. They're parboiled. I'll just rough them up a bit in the pan. Nice hot pan. A bit more rapeseed oil in it. Potatoes go straight in it. Whack those in a really hot oven. Beautiful. I've cooked these leeks right down. Just cook them long enough to get the sweetness out of them. So a touch of white wine vinegar. A little bit of mustard. A bit of the rapeseed oil. I'm going to use the rapeseed itself and peppercorns to make a crust for the beef. Nice hot pan. Get the oil hot. And uh, we're going to put that in the oven for seven or eight minutes. A little bit longer if you like it. Well done. Of course, as you would with any nice bit of steak, we want to rest that. Damn it, Danny's doing. There we go. Those are lovely. It's just a complete no-brainer, this dish. Lovely, delicious, crispy roast potatoes. And then we've got this gorgeous piece of fillet. Look at that. And this delicious, kind of leaky, relishy, chutney type thing. That is really nice. That is very good. And what's lovely is the rapeseed. Add that bit of nuttiness. And get it also in the roast potatoes. And there's a lovely little texture in there too. Lovely little kind of crunchiness from them as, from them as well. Definitely got a lot of potential for the restaurant.